Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining us. My name is Nick. This is my mom, Jen. Hi guys. And we're back with The Sopranos, Season 3, Episode 7. Mm -hmm. So last time we had, like, Meadow at college. She was getting serious with, with Noah, but then he kind of... Noah. <laughs> kicked her to the curb, you know? Yeah. Because yeah, she's so, so negative. It's like, that is the most random thing to say to her, because she's very positive. He's such a fuckboy. He's it's the negative. Just... Yeah. yeah. So yeah, she was kind of upset about that. Yeah. And then... The other big thing, uh, Ralphie kind of showed more of his true colors with his treatment of Tracy. Oh, man, that one bothered me for a while after we watched it. Culminating in him, like, beating her to death. And mm -hmm. Right now, I'm actually not sure who's worse, him or Richie. I think he's worse. Yeah, yeah in a way. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's amazing, because, like, Richie was such a thug and such a, an asshole. Yeah. You know, it, we, it, it's hard to think of anything, anyone worse than him or, like, Livia in terms yeah. of, say, emotional, like, manipulation and damage. Yeah. But then Ralphie just there was a special breed of you know. That's why I just I don't understand why what's her name is Rosalie. With him. Yeah, why? I don't. It's you know why why does any you know woman yeah. end end up like in a, either an abusive situation or with yeah. like, you're you're desperate for love. I don't and know how she ended up with him. Or something because yeah. she was like because she's know, a very attractive woman. Right? Her husband was the boss, yeah. so she's almost like royalty in that yeah. that family. Yeah. And then, you know, him, who's, like, not even, like, a captain. He's, like, a mm. lower-level guy, because Tony won't promote him for yeah. good reason, you know. Well, I hope he's getting his, you guys. I hope he's getting his soon. Yeah, so then at the very end, you know, Tony, you know, laid into him a good little bit, which is very satisfying. But then just from what I've read afterward, that kind of, like, violates, like, the the sort of mafia code. That Tony labeled him one? Yeah. After he beat a person to death? Yeah. Like I say, it, it made, you know, mob code. But, like, just, apparently it's, like, you don't do that to a made guy because like remember that whenever they have to have, like take a hit on another guy they have to get like permission from yeah, the boss it's yeah. like a very special thing yeah because then remember he was like i'm a made guy you yeah can't. so maybe there's gonna be ramifications for that you know tony's the boss so it's hard to see but it's he was very shook just because you know tracy was around meadows well, age yeah, you know yeah and he'd been through the whole that whole episode she'd been bringing him banana bread and various other yeah. conversations and stuff yeah so yeah we'll see if that'll get referenced and yeah in the meantime let's get watching i want you to count backwards from 10. 10. well junior's having a surgery ah uh. you have be nephew tony cooperate fully help take him down what do i get guaranteed cure no more can uh <laughs> <laughs> Edgy Dickinson. <laughs> uh, uh. Well, usually when you go under, you don't have to dream anything. Yeah. So nice. It's the best nap you can have. <laughs> Your uncle is a very strong man, Mr. Soprano. He did very well. The news is all good. Beautiful. So the cancer is... Gone? You bet. I took a tumor the size of a fist out of his stump. Oh. Wow. Ooh. You're too fucking worried about what I give you. Uh, Worry a little more about what you give me. Blow me with your lectures, boy. <laughs> Kid, you wearing a wire? <laughs> when I was coming up, this would never happen to new made guys. But too many people are doing a simulcast. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, between Sal and, and the other guy yeah. who's currently uh, being an informant, you know? Yeah. I said everything. Go fuck yourself. Before I was breaking balls. Now you're beginning to worry me. All right. I guess you could call that a dick. Oh no. <laughs> uh. What? He's no Angelo Stamper, that's all. What is that supposed to mean? You know Angelo was dying to marry you. Oh god. Uh, <laughs> I need to be excused. Yeah. My turn. <laughs> Like she's been married a long time. You don't bring up some old boyfriend that... No. Bullshit. Oh, really, Dad? The contract you got to do with Sparta High for the hurricane repairs? What, all the other builders were too busy to bid? Oh, please. Hmm. Hmm. Always fun when the parents come to visit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the fish. Ah! I love those things. <laughs> Remember that, like, yes. fever dream about yeah. Shell? Yeah, he'll be throwing this out the window. Four dollars a pound. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, Come on. I pay you a fucking shower. The poor guy already lost an eye. Working back for a bunch of animals, that's why. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> Look at that framing. Oh, yeah. I was say, what? This doctor. Oh, Dr. Melfi. Oh. By herself. Either Tony is missing or maybe oh. just talk to her. Maybe, yeah. The fact is, Tony isn't under the weather today. He just didn't feel like coming. Fuck that shit, I think he said, okay? Usually <laughs> happens when we touch on it. Yeah, she's used to it by now. Here's a number of a colleague in Livingston. He was a teacher of mine. That really won't be necessary, but thank you anyway. Oh, is that going to be Elliot? Maybe, yeah. Mm. He just came all that way, didn't get too much done. Yeah. It's possible, though. There may be some malignant cells we didn't get. Oh, yeah. That's a trouble. We took a small sampling of the tumor from the frozen section. When we got back the complete results, it showed nodal involvement. Oh. Uh, when can he eat regular food again? I'd guess two weeks. So let's fill out the surgical consent form sign. That's one less thing you have to deal with in the hospital. Well, it's a question for a doctor. Yeah. Me, you say sign, I sign. You tell me to take a crap on a deck of the Queen Mary, an hour later they're hosing it down with disinfectant. <laughs> uh. Carmilla! Hi. Oh, she saw her there. What a yeah. She's... Was she avoiding her? or? Why don't you come for dinner? It's just me and Tony with med at school, and AJ's on a field trip. Who knows, maybe we'll get lucky and Tony won't show. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Angie, that dog is not a substitute for human contact. That French poodle is all I got left to sell. <laughs> hmm. But where am I going to come up with $1,200? I mean, Tony yes. helps out, and I am so grateful. I, it covers the basics, but anything extra, there's no way, Carmilla. Jeez, oh, Angie, I'm sorry. That, that must be so tough. Oh, my God. Let me guess. They, they fell off a truck. Yeah. <laughs> I hope he brings home the right size, eh? <laughs> Not like a coat where, you know, yeah. a little bit either way, but... Oh. What size are these? Ten. Ten? That's Sasquatch size, Christopher. I'm an eight and a half. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh... Where'd I get ten from? Yeah, where? I'll get you eight and a halves tomorrow. All of them? <laughs> Except for that Spock Cone Pauly. Fuck him and the Coupe uh... de Billy wrote in. Mm. He's saying you hold him back again. Well, like I'm gonna give that prick a full share. Come here. Are oh, there no friends, eh? And... Yeah. Well, they used to be, but now that he's well, like directly I mean. working for you him, just you know. Turn on them, right? Yeah. I love you, baby. Oh, you fucking better. That's why, in general, they say you know you shouldn't work with family or be careful yeah, about working with yeah. friends. But, Never mind you know. mob family, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Guess who I ran into at the supermarket today? Angie Bumpincero. Oh, French cocoa piece of shit. What's wrong with him? Her. Osteoporosis. Angie needs money for an operation. We'll take it up with pussy. If you can find a fat fuck, wherever the feds put him. Mm. You know, Steak got all the TGI Fridays. He loves their wings. He left Angie holes in the bag, which is not right. <laughs> but he did, aside from them killing him, he did still, because he... Yeah. Who was your most famous? And Bobby Dottilio doesn't count. He's only famous in New Jersey. Okay. <laughs> you know Penn and Teller? Uh, magicians. No. You fucked them. Penn. And I didn't fuck him. I gave him head. Penn Gillette? I was there with Georgette. He followed me into the ladies' room. And he acted. Oh, life contour. Get the fuck out of my Ow. sight. What? In the fucking oh, bathroom? Who's this? I don't know, but they're pounding. Not just a regular knock. For fuck's sake, Paulie, it's two in the morning. I know. It's an outrage. You can't fucking do this like this. I can't. You must have not read up on the latest rules. What's he doing? Checking up on him again to see if he's... Yeah. Oh, the shoes. Make yourselves comfortable. But just have a little look around. Well, and like you said, you know, he not giving like all of what he should to Polly. Mm -hmm. So maybe Polly caught on. Yeah. Know, 
Comme ça. Ah. Motherfucker. Hmm. Gonna get into a fight one of these days. Yeah. Jesus, it reeks of cigarettes in here. You're not smoking, are you? Caitlin. It's a whole smoking now. It's a whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> How was the drama queen doing anyway? Fine. Can we not talk about this, please? I'm trying very hard here, Med. If you want me to leave, I will leave. I have an hour before my lunch with Dean Ross. You're going to lunch with the Dean? Can we not talk about this now, please? <laughs> <laughs> to make sure you're recovered from this Noah thing. I'm worried it'll affect your grades. You call losing a wonderful man because of dad a thing? No, no. Yeah. I only kept seeing him plenty long enough after that business with your father. Look, don't drag me into whatever bullshit, accommodational pretense you've got worked out with daddy. What was that, last night's reading assignment? <laughs> oh, God. What did he put in there? Like meatloaf or something? Yeah. A bunch of milk. Oh. <laughs> God. Oh. Oh no no. Oh. Well, you know you're getting better. That's the important thing. You look better too. If you're gonna lie to me, tell me there's a broad waiting in the car. Wants to tongue my balls. Hey, you want that? It's a phone call away. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Don't want this. I gotta get nutrition somehow. Kennedy says eat only what I can sip to a straw. Well, you didn't even blend it yet. Oh, no. Oh, no, God, no. Meat and milk, which is a combination I love, but not... Not like that. Not blended together. Ralphie. You don't got enough on your plate? I mean, in your blender? <laughs> Kennedy, it's cut, zip, over and out. He has the hands of an angel. And don't forget his name. What? I'm supposed to be impressed because the man's name is John Kennedy? All the mixed name their kids that after the guy got killed. <laughs> oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ. Can't hurt to make a call. People come from the city to see Kennedy. Good, then we won't be fighting traffic. All right, you set it up. You come with me. What, he thinks he should get a second opinion? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't think the other doctor's doing fine so far, right? So far, it seems really at good. all, and... Yeah. Yeah. Anthony is a cunt here away from owning all of Northern Jersey. And I am that cunt here. So maybe he has something else on his mind beside my full, complete, and speedy recovery. Ah, uh, Junior, all this cynicism. This can't be good for you. <laughs> Such a grouch. Yeah. Uh oh. oh. What's happening? Whose house are we going to here? Uh. Oh. Oh no. What the hell? The money I give you. You're driving a Cadillac and you're looking for more? Hmm. Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> she don't look sick. It comes and goes. Oh. Okay. She just wanted more money. Interesting. Okay. See the large black marble wall to the right of the entrance? Ah, uh, yes. That's where the donor names will be inscribed. Everybody who donates gets their name up there? The wall is reserved for people whose commitment begins at the $50,000 level. <laughs> That's what the giving committee felt you'd be comfortable with. The giving committee. Based on your past generosity to the Verbum Day School. It's like with my university. I gave them 50 bucks like five years ago. Yeah. They, they haven't stopped emailing, emailing me since. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll throw it on the bed. I'm going to do your household account so you can write them a check. And that's it. Not a penny more. Well, and she was talking with that guy. Like, he goes on family kayaking trips mm -hmm. with, with his wife and kids. And... Yeah. Dr. Krakauer? Hi, yes. Thanks for calling me back. I was referred by a doctor, Jennifer Melfi. Yes, I would. Anytime that's good for you. Yeah, she needs someone to talk to, yeah. you know. You like it with pulp. Not this much. <laughs> the fuck was that for? I'll write you up a list. <laughs> oh, AJ's back. Oh, from the trip? Oh, yeah. honey, I missed you so much. Yeah. He could care less. <laughs> you know, I figured out that this is the longest we have ever been away from each other. Did you miss me? Sure. <laughs> How was it? Yeah, it was pretty good. They had PlayStation 2 right in the hotel room. 
That was it. That was the sum total of your trip to your <laughs> nation's <laughs> capital. I guess. Mm -hmm. All the money you give to Angie Bump and Sarah, and who knows what other widows you've got on your <laughs> But there's not enough to make sure your own daughter is protected. I won't pay. I know too much about extortion. Mm. He's a sick fuck. He was sniffing her fucking panties. What? You heard me. Look, I don't deny that Paulie can be a little quirky. <laughs> so be a big boy and suck it up. Gonna come to a head somehow, eh? Yep. I didn't know they did like a, a board Dr. thing Kennedy for like one patient. Yeah. Oh yeah. They probably have a whole list of patients to go through, right? True. Your patient sought a second opinion with Dr. Maida. Uh, well, forget it then. Last thing I need is to operate with that little shit looking over my shoulder. Uh oh. Hmm. <gasps> oh no. Luke Kennedy took him off his. Don't sugarcoat it. Oh! Yeah. If you concentrate on your breathing, it'll be easier all around. Be furious at Tony now. Mm-hmm. You sniff that girl's panties. He told you that? I'm not apologizing. You out of line. He's gonna marry the girl, for Christ's sake. <laughs> yeah. As of the wedding day? Boy, the lines that they have are bizarre, eh? Yep. I can't do it. Yeah. Kennedy was right. What's he got to say? I can't get him on the phone. The nurses won't put me through to him. Jeez. He didn't call you back? Well, who knows if they even tell him. Last night, the machine says, if it's an emergency, press six. So I press six. Still no call back. 24 hours later. He must be very busy. Yeah. That must be it. Well, when we started... He's ghosting you now. Tony said, you know... I can let me know if I can do anything for you. He was all in his debt. Yeah. I think he's gonna pay him a little visit now. Yeah. <laughs> like what the hell, you know? Yeah. Brought her up. Uh. See, just when you think there's nothing left. Oh yeah. You can always go more. Yeah. Bye. He's got Adriana. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and calling her up, you yeah. know, Pahur for. Her yeah. past experience. Yeah, and... like after he asked her and they were, oh no. Oops. Paul is going to be pissed that he went to Tony about all this. Oh, or... yes. He's yes, like, you know, is. this yeah. little thing, you bust my balls or. Yeah. You want more shoes? What? No. Funny thing is, they don't even fit her. I don't know why I thought she was a size 10. I don't <laughs> know either. He thought Adriana was a size 10 too. Yeah. <laughs> You ever go whining to the big man again about shit between you and me? We'll have a problem, my friend. There we go. Yeah. Oh, the shoes. Yeah. You seen these? Oh. oh. No. Oh, no. <laughs> we gotta bring one into the club. <gasps> these were big for a while. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, the doctor. Watch and learn, Phil. Oh. Yep. Tony's gonna pay a visit here. Oh god! Oh no! He's got a, a bow around the. Yeah. Oh jeez. Oh. <laughs> but I really can't accept it. For everything you've done for my uncle. Anyway, what am I gonna do with it? I already got one in Mr. Williams here. Mr. Williams. <laughs> Stupid the fucking game. Um. <laughs> there are worse things that can happen to a person. Than cancer. My uncle thinks he's gonna die. He's convinced of it. Now you know how old people are with their superstitions. He thinks it's because he went against you. <laughs> I was a surgeon, that's all. You gotta be on you at. <laughs> Answer his oh, phone God. calls. <laughs> Yeah, even if you're not going to be, you know, the surgeon anymore, you could still be talked to the guy and say, I know it's rough, but... Yeah. Cheryl, make sure Mr. Soprano is scheduled for two... Just remember mm. it. One, he's... Tri like, he, this whole thing gave him a bruised ego, and he's just, exactly. like, like, ghosting him because... Yeah, of instead of, you know, having another doctor look over my shoulder, that patient can just suck at it. Eh? Yeah. 
Everybody's marriage has problems. Is he seeing another woman? Huh? Oh, it's a different. Uh, yeah, you can make that plural. Yes, he sees other women. You tell me he's a depressed criminal, prone to anger, serially unfaithful. Is that your definition of a good man? Mm-hmm. His crimes, they are... Uh, Extensive. Yeah. Organized crime. The mafia. Oh, Jesus. Ooh. Yeah. Saying it out loud, eh? Yeah. All I did was make sure he's got clean clothes in his closet and dinner on his table. So a neighbor would be a more accurate job description for you than an accomplice. My apologies. Take only the children, what's left of them, and go. My priest said I should try and work with him, help him to be a better man. How's that going? <laughs> yeah. I'm not charging you because I won't take blood money. You can't either. One thing you can never say that you haven't been told. Hmm. Wow, eh? Yeah. Oh, the doctor's gonna come down. I don't know how much more of this I can take. You taking good care of this young man? There we go. You got a top guy here. Him? Guy, I'd go see if I needed to. Don't be a son of a bitch. <laughs> Stay strong and keep fighting, all right? That's my home number. You start to feel punk? <laughs> I'll check back on you Wednesday. Take good care of this young fella. <laughs> Everybody else in this family sleeps all day. I thought I'd try it. You, uh, depressed? So what to do? This is so different, right? Yeah. Because she's always on everything. That Dean called today. Well, that can't be good. I told him to put us down for the 50000 Ooh. You got to do something nice for me today. You got to do this. Why don't go to 10? That should be enough for those Morningside Heights gangsters. I already told him 50. Ooh. 50 Gs. David. Yes. You look like you could use a night off from cooking. We say we go out. She probably has to change. Can't really wear that to the restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> the Afghan from the couch. Yeah. Okay. Alrighty. Ah. <laughs> You've got a bee on your hat. <laughs> oh, yeah. that was such a funny little, little yeah. moment there. And then just like then like slowly backing him towards the water. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he did a real shit thing. Because, right? like, at before we saw that board thing, he came across as just, like, a very knowledgeable, very mm -hmm. good doctor. Like, mm -hmm. we can understand why Junior was comfortable with him. Yeah. But then, with the moment that his approach was questioned, he got all butthurt. Yeah. You know, he let his, yeah. his ego get in the way. That was a very kind of terrible thing well, to do. Well, Junior just... thought it was Tony trying to take him out, and it's the other way. He was trying to help him. Mm hmm Right? But you can never trust anybody. You don't... Yeah. Nothing anybody ever says or does can be just face value, right? Well, and it's funny, just for, you know, how much of a, like, like being in the mob, you know, like in all the stuff that he probably did back in the day, you know, Junior and everything. Yeah. These days, he's just a, a sick, scared old man, you yeah. know, because yeah. like with, with uh, like Bobby's dad dying last time around and then Livia and everything, like, you know, death is on his mind. And then now with the yeah. cancer, like he, it's not something he can like pay off or, yeah. or kill or beat yeah. up like he can't make it go away yeah so right. it's like you really see kind of the, the really fear come out of another him and, yeah you know like moments of sympathy like for all like you know he used to be the boss that was more of like a you know figurehead thing but it's mm -hmm. like for, for all the power he once had you know he's just reduced to this kind of sad yeah. state and it's yeah. it's something that we can understand you know and, and even sympathize in a couple of moments when he's just like terrified and like almost like crying when they're putting the needle in his arm yeah. and you know, because it's that chemo is rough. Yeah, it is. And like you said, you know, depend, de depending on how severe the cancer is, the, the cure can be worse and make your last week's miserable mm -hmm. and it can still kill you yeah. like the cancer. Yeah. That part with Angie was something, eh? Yeah. Sorry for her. Then you just wanted more money from Tony. 
Because, yeah, like, at first, like, I thought he was going to go, I don't know, kill the dog or something. Yeah. But then he smashed the window, and then it's like, okay, maybe it's just like, you know, being being like a thug, you know, you come yeah. to me with this, don't talk to Carm, whatever. But then yeah. the dog seemed okay, but then it finally kind of clicked, you know, she was... Yeah, comes and goes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, when a dog has, like, what was it, osteo... Whatever it was, osteoporosis? Yeah, I think yeah. that was it. Yeah, it didn't yeah. come and go. Yeah. yeah. So that was a, a neat little twist, you know, mm-hmm. just because, like, with how terrible her marriage was to Sal because of, you know, like his anguish over being a rat. And then with him, like, you know, being gone within the program, like we're all ready to sympathize with her. We, we feel like give her whatever she wants, but Mm -hmm. then we find out she's lying about the, about the whole thing. Yeah. And then playing the, playing the role there with Carm, right. And then now with with Carm, you know, just because even as early as when, that priest like spent the night they watched the movie and everything mm-hmm. remember she she was kind of anguishing she's like i have let evil into my house yeah. but i wanted yeah. these nice things i was willing to overlook yes. so for a long long time she's been you know feeling anguish over well like, and the lawyer just or the uh, therapist just spoke it out right he just said it and that's all the things that she's been feeling and i don't know what do you think she's gonna do right well and and then speaking of when when angie was think about leaping sal remember karm like, yeah, no, tried to talk her into it and it's the church and everything yes. but then but then like when she hugged her she was kind of like telling herself well, you're not going to leave him and everything mm-hmm. but uh, you know so what kind yeah, of so. let's see if you know she's she stood up for herself kind of and said no i want the 50 i mean it's something that she wants then yeah whatever tony thinks it is doesn't matter she wants to do it yeah like one of the so. like handful of people on earth who could get him to change his mind on anything Mm -hmm. because when it comes to his family and you know yeah and now for episode eight i got a like black light going on (laughs) hey oh my god the way you just said hey to me you are so nice Uh uh-oh what oh okay you have to try it I'm so not depressed anymore. Try what? Oh. Uh, <laughs> Ecstasy. I was gonna say. Oh. What the fuck is he doing in Colombia? Oh, Junior. I came up here to see you. Got oh. any more X? For you, the first hit's free. And he was kind of, you know, checking her out last time we saw yeah, her. Yeah, though. yeah, they. And away we go. Read up and suck my dick! Get her! Yes. Oh, that's Tony. Hmm. I wonder how that's gonna end, eh? Yep. Cause he's just begging for it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Break into a smile, huh, Tony? It's almost like a western yeah. thing going on yeah. there with the music, you know? Wanna drink? Another time, Anthony. Another time. Let's whack this cocksucker and be done with it. Yeah. I agree with you, Polly. Oh. Oh. Uh oh, she passed out. I don't wake up. I drank too much fucking tequila. Mm. Come on, I can't stop now. Jackie, be smart now. Yep. This is Tony's daughter. Wow, she's just out. <laughs> yep. Okay, good man. Mm-hmm. Well, he's a good earner. Guy like that. Booth cannon. Yeah. He'll be leaving a house, he'll pull a Jack Ruby on Yep. He bashed that poor girl's brains in. I hear you. I know. She was not related to you by blood or marriage. She was not your gumad. Ralphie's a made guy, Tone. All things considered, he's got a legitimate beef. Oh, just a... Lord, me. You only got two choices. I vote for making him disappear. Yeah. Something in the way of, uh, of an apology. Absolutely fucking not. No, God. Boss or no, you don't raise your hands to another made guy. Rules are rules, otherwise what? Fucking anarchy. <laughs> Look who's talking! I know! <laughs> oh, the hypocrisy is strong with it this is. one. It is, yes. Granted, it's, it's the whole mob culture, but, you know. 
I was supposed to go over there. For Thanksgiving, me and Ro. Tony's. Fuck him and his turkey. I had to shove a drumstick up his ass. <laughs> Who's gonna be there? Besides us, I don't know, Carm's parents. Great. <laughs> How about Meadow? So, Thanksgiving, who's all coming this year? Mm -hmm. well, Nana and Grandpa, Chris and Aide, uh, I think Janice is bringing someone from her prayer group. Oh, wow. Janice's prayer group. I just hung up with Meadow and she was asking if Jackie was coming up at Thanksgiving. Oh, really? Jackie just asked me about her. My radar's up. <laughs> oh, so broke the bar there. Not as many as you think. I need you to call Rosalie and cancel with them. Oh. Enough of this jets and shit. I'm going over to Mr. Spacely's house for dinner. I was just talking to her. What am I going to say? Fine, I'll call. And my excuse won't be nearly as nice as yours. Uh, what's he looking for? Dr. Akavi. <gasps> oh. Gloria Trillo, Globe Mercedes. Hmm. Listen, a pre owned 2001. Oh, she's in the waiting room. Yes. It's like, <laughs> oh, you thought you're she was replacing the new... Dr. Melfi or something. Uh -huh. oh. Flag on the play. I'm pretty sure you said Tuesday. I did? I'll come back next week at the same time and uh, no problemo. I told her she can have my appointment. I could see you tonight at seven. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Okay. Something tells me that won't be the last we'll see of her. No. I'm trying to remember that actress's name. Yeah. Of course, I'll let you know when I know anything more. Okay. Take care, sweetheart. Bye. All right. Bye bye. Mm. Well, she bought it. Yeah. Carm's father, he's sick. She had to cancel Thanksgiving. <laughs> oh. Which he's going to be really mad at because he didn't get to cancel himself, right? Yep. It's Tony's idea, not his. Listen, I want to, I want to ask you about the, the girl, you know, that woman that was here today. What does somebody like that need a shrink for? I can't talk about another patient. That makes you wonder, that's all. Everybody's got stuff. Mm-hmm. So now it's, uh, you know, it's after hours. It's dark. You want me to walk into your car? No, thank you. She's still resisting. Mm-hmm. AJ, did you tell your dad and your grandpa how I served him when I waitressed at Kenny Rogers? Colonel Sanders. No, at Kenny Rogers, Barry Sanders. <laughs> yeah, she served him. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Is he gonna have an attack, did you think, or? But you know I love you more than anything in this world, right? Dad, what are you talking about? Anything will ever happen to you. Everybody, come on, dinner! Hmm. Yeah, puts things into perspective. Yeah. Jackie, honey, you don't have to stay for dessert if you don't want to. Jesus Christ, little manners, huh? What'd she just say? It's okay. Why don't you go see if Meadow wants to go? These two. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't listen to him either. Like, uh, and granted, there is that, but just... All of a sudden, he thinks he can give her son directions and stuff, right? Oh, lordy. Wow. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> narcolepsy is an ASDA certified... I was just going to say, is he narcoleptic? <laughs> Almost time for turkey sandwiches! Wow. Yeah, I'll put oh. more coffee on. <laughs> Jackie. Yeah, they just said Junior Jack. might be coming by to... Yeah. Hey! Jackie, hi! I guess you know everybody. <laughs> Janice's friend. Hey, man. Have you heard the good news? He is risen. Sit down, we're going to have some turkey sandwich. Oh, that's from a prayer group. Okay, man. Yeah. Until then... Here's how you'll get your thrills. <laughs> the Mercedes-Benz Coupes and Convertibles. Oh, Mercedes. They're gonna get one of those. Want a Mercedes? Go ahead. It's a cute car. He means actually the saleswoman. How are things going over there, you know? 
but our friend. No, the same, you know. What's he saying about me? To me? Hmm. Nothing. He knows better. <laughs> We're in the middle of a major renovation at the house. I got two kids getting ready for college, so it's... <laughs> no, it's... Hey, hang in there. You're doing a good job. Yeah, he's a good guy. Yeah. Putting up with a lot of shit. Yes. Should get a bonus just for that. You see those bags? Fucking stress is killing him. Mm. You heard what he did with Thanksgiving? It's not good, Ralph. You were going to go anyway. I'm telling you, John, he's not leaving me a lot of options here. Don't talk crazy. You want to commit yeah. suicide, pills are a lot easier. <laughs> you brought this on yourself with that girl. A, yep. she was a hua. B, she hit me. That wasn't my kid she was carrying. Okay. That's her story. Ralph Ciferetto came by. He wants to apologize. Oh, really? Would that put this to rest? If it's sincere, it might relieve me of a very unpleasant decision. Yeah. You know, they were about to break ground on the Esplanade. Talking about millions of dollars here, Tony. Wouldn't hurt either of us to have a point man in there who feels appreciated. Poor girl just had a 20th birthday. Pop knows what he mentioned. I threw cold water on it right away. Uh-huh. Yeah, Boy, sure. Boy, we're called to sell the angles, eh? Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong. Didn't you say you weren't going to stick your beak in? Can't two friends talk? I talked mm. to him. He's delighted you want to see him. <sighs> oh my God, yeah. <laughs> What's he going to do to make that right? Just talk to him. He indicated he's very open to working something out. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So they're both going to stand there waiting for an apology. Yep. Sometimes I just want to scream in her face. Quit whining. No wonder he left you. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you have feelings of your own, and who is listening? That's right, damn it. I have to sit there and take care of these people hour after hour. Yeah. I could never do it. And some of them are very real and very serious. And I'm sorry. I care. I really do. But it's hard sometimes. I just want to say... I hurt! Yeah. You've been through such trauma. It takes tremendous strength of will and inner resource to soldier on as you do at your work. Yeah, because it's a different job to go back to after you've had your own trauma. Yes. You now help instill all the other people with their traumas. Yeah, it's not just like doing an office job. Yeah, or, you yeah. Know. Okay, see how this goes. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> you want to see me? Yeah, Tony. About what? About what? Oh, no. <laughs> you told them both of the, uh... <laughs> oh, God. So awkward. Yeah. I said some things, and I did some things. It's not going to happen again. What'd you do? Uh, yep. Be specific. Yep. And I disrespected the Bing. By doing? And the girl. That shouldn't happen. Like I said, I, I was doing a lot of coke. I'm sorry, Tony. Okay? I was waiting for Tony to say sorry he hit him. Yep. At the house? <laughs> <laughs> He's going to be so pissed when he leaves here, right? Yep. Calm down. Take it easy. He let me stand there like a, a servant, uh, scraping, bowing. Cocksucker didn't even invite me to sit down. It's pastoring. It's part of the game. Fuck the game. He's going down. Oh, what are you fucking stupid coming in here talking to me like... <laughs> I've given my life to this thing. And this is the thanks I get? Fine, make a move. Ooh. Oh, buddy. Between all the all the stress and... He's going to have a heart attack here. A lot of men have heart attacks doing this. I this mean... exact thing. Yeah. Seriously cannot be... Oh. 
It's like more of his hair is gone. Yeah. Grandpa, you ever work for somebody named Trillo? There was somebody named Trillo. He had seven daughters. I can't oh. remember. Seven daughters? So I guess she's one of them? Maybe, yeah. Must be. So I take Gigi out. What the fuck would I replace him with anyway? All good questions. Great. It's the fuck I answer. Who says there is one? <laughs> Heavy lies the head that wears the crown. Yeah. Uh, How much longer, Skip? I gotta take a leak. Oh, he's no. a captain, isn't he? Gigi, in the yeah. Bathroom? Yeah, I think he's... Oh, Jesus, I think he croaked. Yeah, probably. Jesus. Oh. Yeah, I bet he had a heart attack. The poor guy. Oh. Damn. <laughs> oh. Spent his final weeks just a wreck. Yeah. Yeah, he said he had kids ready to go to college. Yeah, and... yeah. So is a vacancy. You thought about who it's going to be? Ugh. Ralphie's up next, right? But He's the best earner in yeah. that crew, you know? Okay, so we have him. Him. Or... Him. Him. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. Or him. <laughs> Not a lot of good choices there. Can't we call like a like a temp agency? Yeah, or, you know, have yeah. them send us someone. And like they said, it would it would placate him, you know, for now at least. Yeah. Making you captain. You are. That's great. Oh. I'm still waiting for an apology, right? We're gonna have a drink together, or what? Ooh. Basically, screw you. Yep. Yeah, rack them. You said you were gonna take me. Go sit down. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh. Meadow. Meadow. Oh no. Well, she was being really stupid. Yeah. Oh no. Jesus, Meadow, you alright? I think so. Easy. Oh. No. You okay, sweetie? My purse is stuck. Okay. She can, she can move. Yeah. I'm so sorry. You know, as long as you're okay, I don't know what I would have done if you would have got hurt. You almost died. I'm so sorry. You almost died. <laughs> wow, here. Yep. Yeah, and I guess just he was checking with Junior because, like, he recognized the name. They got, like, shared family history, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, my grandfather worked with your father kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, That actress, I'm trying to think of her name. I recognize her. Yeah. Dale? Yeah? I'm going out. 600. <laughs> Tony, Tony, Tony. Mm -hmm. Everything all right? Yeah, yeah, fine. Oh, that was wine coolers. Uh oh. Oh. Okay, I'll see you next week. No On the boat. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we got some ducks. Yeah. We got ducks, people. Yeah. <laughs> There's the Mercedes. Hmm. What's her name? On the show? Last name was Trillo. Ah. Tracy. There. Annabelle is here. There we go. Oh. Yeah. So. Okay. I feel real bad for Gigi. Yeah. He was the one nice guy that. The poor bastard was so stressed oh. having to, to deal with all that bullshit. You know, just he was glad for a moment of silence. And I didn't know by saying, you know, guys die like that on the toilet, pushing so hard. Look what you did. I know. You killed him. <laughs> now we have to deal with Ralphie in a more powerful <laughs> position. So thanks a lot. <laughs> and Ralphie, hey? Ugh. But Tony held held strong he wasn't apologizing no no as he shouldn't have you know yeah. he totally had it coming but we can see now that like it's it's not so much ralphie and johnny sack are like conspiring it's that johnny sack is using ralphie yeah to like meddle in tony's affairs yeah. to like manage him you know yeah cause... yeah 
Because it's like, you know, like you said, New York and Sopranos, they have a longstanding history, but, mm -hmm. you know, maybe it's like, because half the time Junior says that Tony is, is say, um, impulsive and, you know, yeah. throwing his weight around and maybe like yeah. others kind of feel that way. So they're maybe like managing him by if they have someone like Ralphie who's willing to do anything yeah. as their their guy Back on the up. inside. Yeah, right. So yeah. we'll see where that goes with, you know, because like Johnny Sack, it feels like he feels like he's playing more of like a long game where he'll back tony if if it goes that way or he'll back mm -hmm. ralphie that because he was yeah. telling both of them yeah he was the one to deal yeah <laughs> yeah yeah he just kept telling me yeah back and forth what the what each other wanted to hear yeah 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 we'll kind of see kind of the like whether it's just him or maybe like new york families in general want mm -hmm. want to kind of have like a stronger influence in jersey yeah maybe eh? yeah and then all the meadow this, and jackie looks like yeah they're getting a little bit serious and mm -hmm. she was being just a little bit of an idiot right there at well, the end the you end, know just prop stupid. drinking a bit and yeah you know just play stupid games and win stupid yeah, prizes yeah exactly you know, right. just, she's like she didn't get hurt or hurt yes, somebody else exactly yeah yeah okay oh more fun and games at the yeah, soprano hustle right. yeah. and like i just love you know that whole final touch where it's like you know he pretty much had no choice with making ralphie captain because he it's like well yeah Re regar the, yeah. regardless of like whether he's a total asshole and other words i won't use in uh, distinguished yeah. company yeah but he's a good earner and he's like good for the business so mm -hmm. at least for now and that's what you have to weigh right is the but i love how like you know he gave him that but then he's like oh are we gonna have a drink it's like yeah then walk he walked away. out he didn't say anything oh so satisfying yeah it's like letting him know like on a professional level I'm going to work with you, but on a personal level, go fuck yourself. That's right. Yeah. But that's just going to get under his skin. Absolutely. Yeah. Like you said, like you kept saying, it wasn't that Tony canceled for Thanksgiving. It's that Ralph didn't get a chance to say no. Yeah. Because then, yeah. Because then Tony would have been the like insulted party yes, or like, he, exactly. like Ralph would have won one yeah. over on him. Yeah. <laughs> More fun in games. Yeah. At, at least these episodes weren't as, you know, uh, like, up like in your face brutal as mm -hmm. the last couple of videos we've done where yeah. like you know episode four and six those were pretty rough to get through yeah and uh and also um whenever when they were like getting, getting ready for thanksgiving on the like plastic bags there was like a missing sign or whatever did you notice that no on the the one bags it was like uh it was like one of those like milk carton uh, type things oh, okay. it was, like, missing and it showed someone's picture uh, I, I wonder if that it was either tracy or maybe someone else but uh, just i i saw the, that on the bag oh, a couple yeah. times like the huh. brought, brought some stuff over to gg oh, or whatever so huh. i'm not sure if it's just like another little reference yeah, to that right. but maybe eh? yeah so yeah more fun with the sopranos yeah thanks so much for joining us hopefully you guys enjoyed as well mm -hmm. if you want to watch the full length of our reaction i'll put a link down to our patreon below Check out this and all the other movies and shows that we do. A lot of exclusives aren't on YouTube, so check those out. Yes. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. It really helps us. It helps the channel grow. And, uh, yeah, that's all we have for you today. So we will see you later. Bye, guys. Bye.